What's going on guys and girls? Um, I have a 2023 Dodge Charger RT. Um, I did some work on my um, intake and I had to disconnect my battery. Um, and when I reconnected it, it did not, the Uconnect did not work properly. It, the, the display was totally different. Uh, my Super Track was not working. Uh, neither was all my buttons displaying as far as my apps and everything is concerned. Uh, it's like maybe like, I don't know, 20 up here instead of, uh, or actually maybe like 10. I'm not sure how many it was, but um, everything is set back to how it was before. Um, however, I just had a situation where my sound stopped working. My radio was on, my sound stopped working. So, um, I had to unplug uh, some fuses in the back and the Uconnect disconnected again and it only had a certain amount of buttons. My Super Track was not working. Um, you know, all that stuff was just, it just wasn't working at all. And so, um, what I had to do was, um, I'm gonna show you a quick, tip on how to reset because I, I was told that you can press and hold up and hold the down arrow buttons on the, the climate control or you can uh, turn the off button uh, for the volume I mean it, nothing was working but I did some research and I found that if you hold down the tune button and the volume button at the same time just hold it down for I'll say maybe 10 seconds then release it It'll turn the, it'll say Dodge, and it'll turn the whole screen black. And then it'll reset itself and it'll come up to your regular, uh, how you regularly had it set. So again, if the down button for the climate control and the um, the power button for the, ra uh, for the radio does not work for you, what you do is just hold down the tune button and the volume button for like 10 seconds, and it will reset your um, you connect and everything should look back to go back to normal i hope this helps someone out there uh because i was I, I had a hard time finding actually how to how to reset it so all right guys have a good one